the past like 15 years before car industry does not put much of uh, electronics into the car because previously they think the chips are not reliable we try to reduce the defects if it is there we want to catch it in the factory itself so we don't want to go into the car and car stops midway and causing inconvenience to the driver so if you see some of my patterns all are related to reducing defects or improving the reliability of the chip For example, we have the mobile robots, which look like the Star Wars R2-D2 moving around carrying production materials. Besides that, we also have vehicles carrying production materials flying over you in the factory floor. Mobile robots help in the loading and unloading of the manufacturing staff. This reduces their manual workload and thus enable them to better concentrate on their more important job tasks. When I work night shift, um, there's no engineer at all, so I have to handle everything myself. When I get to handle everything properly, independently, I feel very proud of myself. I like shift work because it gives me more free time so that I have a better social life. It's 12 hours, slightly more than 9 hours, and you get 2 days work, 2 days rest, and after 2 months of day shift, you'll go to 2 months of night shift. I started my career doing shift work and supervising the manufacturing staff. Engineers doing normal shift will only get to know the process issues. However, when you do shift work, you communicate with the manufacturing staff and know their difficulties. You also get to build a bond with them and know them from all walks of life. Um, actually, I have no background in semiconductor, so for the first three months, it's very tough for me. But then they gave me um, trainings and I even joined the manufacturing team to learn the line issue as well. For the core development framework level one, you will go to the clean room and it's all about hands-on training. So after that, level two, you will go to more of data analysis. And then at level three, you will take on the role of a shift leader and you will learn all the shift pass down and ISing with other departments. As part of my continuous uh, improvement, so I was sent to Netherlands for a year to my parent company to work with experts there. Semiconductor industry in Asia is quite young and in Europe they have started long back. So they started with uh, this small wafer to this big wafer now. So you can understand how much experience they have. Basically, my diploma was not directly related to the semicon industry. My specialist diploma focuses more on wafer fabrication and it helps me understand more about my work. When I have to study, my supervisor let me off early or came in late during my night shift or day shift. Lah. My ambition is to be an engineer when I'm young, so I hope to pursue my degree. Lah. Here in SSMC, uh, actually we know everybody in the company and even the CEO knows some of the engineers' name. So we are like one family here. SSMC cares a lot for its employee. It organizes a lot of activities such as Zumba, yoga, kickboxing during the lunch hours for all employees to take part. We are living in an information age. We need electronics to collect information, store, process and also transmit information. So this industry is going to flourish. In this industry, experience is like red wine. Older is better. You will always have good future.